just as much some of our b-list celebrities or sorry c-list celebrities are dishing out relationship advices most especially the women talking about tacha those big brother nigeria housemates the women and uh, some other women in the music in the movie industry just as much they are coming out to dish relationship advices please they should also try as much as possible to save for their future. You know, most relationship advices they dish is that do not date broke boys, don't go for broke men, cheat on broke men, don't go for broke men, date people's husband. Those are the only relationship advices they usually dish to the public. Well, the reason why I'm saying it, this, uh, there is this popular Ghanaian socialite. This girl is currently, a woman, she is currently seeking for aid. Just like we have some of our celebrities here in Nigeria who are advising young girls not to date broke boys. This girl was also doing such things in Ghana. She was doing such things in Ghana. And her name is uh, Moisha. I know some of you may have heard about this girl before. Apparently, years ago, she repented. And even in Ghanaian media, they believe Moisha had something to do with whiskey. They believe Moisha, whiskey don't bang Moisha before. With so many of our Nigerian celebrities, she has something to do with them. Mostly married people. Well, unfortunately, Moisha is down. She's really, really sick. And now she's asking for assistance. But Ghanaians don't want to assist her. Ghanaians don't want to donate money for her. Apparently, she's, uh, she's, she's down with stroke. And now, her brother, what her brother wrote, according to uh, the media in Ghana, they said, Ghana socialite Moisha has reportedly suffered a stroke, affecting her mobility and speech. As confirmed by her brother, Ibito, he, uh, he has opened a GoFundMe account seeking financial assistance to cover a medical bill the account has received 570 dollars so far out of 10,000 us dollar target out of 10,000 us dollar target she has received approximately 570 dollars that's poor Ghanaians now Ghanaians help your social light if it was nigerian for example if i may ask this question to my nigerian brothers and sisters for example, if Tasha now, tomorrow, God forbid, oh, something happened to Tasha and Tasha is seeking for financial support, will you donate for Tasha? This is coming from Moesha brother. Uh, I think she, she, he said, hi, I am a Beatle. My sister Moesha recently experienced a life altering stroke and a journey to recovery has, been, has just begun. The impact of stroke on her life has been immense, affecting her mobility, speech, and overall quality of life. But we believe in the power of God, love, support, and community to bring about positive change. By contributing to this campaign, you will be directly supporting my sister rehabilitation journey. This fund will be used to cover medical expenses, uh, therapy season, assistive uh, device and any other resources needed to aid her recovery. My goal is to provide my sister with the best possible care and support during the challenging times. We want to help her regain her independence, rebuild her strength and restore her ability together. We can make a significant impact on our journey to recovery. Thank you from the bottom of our heart for your kindness, compassionate and generosity, your support means everything to us and to our beloved sister. Let's come together as community and make a lasting impact on our journey to recovering. When she had the opportunity to make a lasting impact on other ladies' art, uh, ladies art not to go the same way that she has gone, what was she doing? She was busy flexing her body online and going to Dubai to hang out with married people, you know, knack for money and everything i'm not the one making all those such claims so it's the Ghanaian media and there are videos proof of how she constantly asks women 
young ladies not to date broke guys. Ask young ladies not to date broke, anybody broke. This guy who is a part of a Ghanaian media said, after many Dubai trips, regular shopping at expensive shops, sleeping with celebrities, dating multiple sugar daddies and married men, owing cars etc. It will be nonsensical for any Ghanaian to donate to Moisha. Renowned Ashawo can't afford 10k. Lesson to Aija B2. Renowned Ashawo can't afford <laughs> can't afford 10k dollars. But if she was about that life, she sh she should have been able to save now, to save well for her future. Or let her reach out to Whiskey. Apparently, she has something to do with Whiskey. That is apparently according to Ghanaian media. But we never know any of our Whiskey being with uh, Moisha from Ghana. I don't think so. We never heard about it. Maybe they may have had something, but that will be secrecy. Because we know our own Machala. Machala know they agree say they the relationship with anybody. Hmm? Well, if that's the case, eh, let her, I think from her proceed from doing all those three Dubai trip or low show work, she should not be able to save money now. She has cars. Let her sell one of the cars now. Or let her do something. I am not a Ghanaian. I have no responsibility to this girl to fund. No Nigeria has any responsibility to this girl to fund. Ghanaians are there. Ghanaians, please donate money. Donate to save your social life. Who have imparted in your in the future of your young girls. Be it she has, she has imparted well or she has not imparted well, it's your own to judge to know if you want to donate and all What about the Olosho Association of Ghana? The Ashawa Association of Ghana. They can as well donate now. After all, they learned from someone. They they, they picked inspiration from somebody. So one of your members is currently down. And in fact, let us not forget, apparently Moisha repented years, about few years, about two years or three years ago, there were this rumor that she repented, her pastor took her wealth or whatsoever, but I wasn't really, really following that story though. So let's forget about Moisha. I want to give you a good news, guys. I'm so, so happy for two superstars now coming from Nigeria. That is Border Boy of, uh, and, and Fields. They are currently being featured on Usher's new album that is coming out on the 9th of February. That is next week here. Usher's new album is coming out after many years. Usher decided to drop an album and is featuring one of Nigeria's biggest artists, Border Boy and the other guy, Fields. So Phil said he was the one that produced the track for Bonner Boy and Usher and also his track as well that Usher featured him on. That's actually nice. So that's good, man. I'm so so happy. So far, so good. Eh? Bonner Boy this year, last year alone, is the most featured entertainer. If I mean featured entertainer eh, artist, like real feature, not be all those. Eh, Bezek, Bezek, small, small, small future, uh, uh, featured. He tried though, he tried. Osha, the old Osha. Whoever thought of a day will come, our Nigeria entertainers will be featured on an international album. Whoever thought. We were the one begging them before. We were the one begging them to say, oh, let, let us work with you. Let we work with us. We paid so much millions of dollars trying to work with us, those international artists, but now they are the one coming to us. Is that not, is that not wonderful? You have to be able to, you have to be ready to sacrifice. To all those heroes that have sacrificed so much, eh, all thanks to them, to their debunch, they made a startup, and their Idris Abu Karim there that wanted to start it that time. All thanks to them, they tried. They tried, really. Let's be honest, they tried. All thanks to them. All thanks to them. Big up to them, man. If not, if they weren't trying during their own time, we wouldn't be here today. 
that is the same thing we were trying. We are still trying to teach our Ghana brothers and sisters out there, the celebrities, the artists out there. You guys should be able to bet on yourself. Go out and invest on yourself. People, they, they do not want to bet on themselves. The money to the heart for them to come off for hand. They just want to relax. Bet on yourself. Even, even though it's not going to come to you, bet on yourself so that it can come to your brother. But they don't, man. They don't. I'm so, so happy for Bonner Boy, man. And I can't wait to listen to that uh, track. Himself and Usher. Wow. Himself and Usher. That track would be dope.